in the West, the ability to use language and to perform intellectual gymnastics has always been seen as a marker of intelligence. In the East, the ability to abide in the here and now, free of thought, has always been seen as a marker of great meditative accomplishment. And anyone who's tried to do that knows just how difficult it is. This very different Eastern approach puts the whole matter of animal sentience in a very different perspective. What if animals are actually more mindful than we are? What if they're able to access more subtle levels of consciousness more easily than we can? In recent years, animal scientists have done a whole lot of experiments showing that animals are a lot more perceptive, knowing, and compassionate than was hitherto believed. And these findings have massive implications for the way that we treat animals here on planet Earth. Buddhism has always suggested that animals are sentient beings who deserve our respect and our love. And in our own inner journey, Buddhism encourages us to start where we are, at home, including with our loved animal companions. The animals in our lives are mindful sentient beings capable of great inner development. We have it within our power to greatly help or hinder them in this development. This is an awesome responsibility and a wonderful privilege.